Hello, people, it's Pokecon14, and I am back. Uh, no need for the saving screen there, but welcome to part 31 of Shiny Pokemon Diamond and Pearl Walkthrough. And now I have to say one thing. Thank you, Cerebi! Yes, I finally put up the move sets for the Pokemon Diamond and Pearl after like four years on the uh, stupid screen thing. Yeah, you're not a screen, you're just a screen thing. Just an impersonator. Someone that hopes to be a screen someday. Uh, this... Yeah, I'm gonna go with Aquazelle and Bon... No, wait, no, not Bonsai, um... The yeah, Aquazelle up front. Cause, you know, he's not gonna get much action in the next gym, and... Now, we're gonna start off here with our first battle. And finally... Finally what, you may ask? Well, I just lost my train of thought, but finally... Here are the Pokemon's moves. Psychic Abigail is done now, so let's head over here. I'll be taking both paths of this route, but in here you see this guy, the Rune Maniac. Uh, unknown, yeah. He's get, just gonna keep chipping away until you, if you have all 26 forms of the unknown, then you will be able to come up all 26 letters of un- oh, TN28 dig there. Okay, now what I was saying, if you get all 26 forms of unknown then he will be done with this tunnel and you can go into the top floor and catch the question mark and exclamation mark unknown so now no more pokemon battles i am out of that cave and yeah it's going to become more important later uh nothing in the rocks if there is then i'm just stupid okay i don't care okay i'm going to be going on this side of the route first just because i feel like it and yeah, whatever. Uh, you can either battle this trainer or go through the grass. I'm gonna have to battle the trainer anyway, so I'll go through the trainer thing. And now, I have beaten him, and I'm switching Pokemon. Uh, actually, right now, I'm going to catch a new Pokemon on my team. Yeah, a new Pokemon. So, I'll cut till I find it. Here we go. It is a Ponyta. Most of you probably guessed this, because uh, I don't have a Fire-type on my team, and I'm actually in a different spot of grass, because I deposited a Pokemon. The egg, actually, not really a Pokemon. It's going to be a Pokemon, but... So we're going to have Ponyta in the party. So, now, let's catch this thing. After it growls at us. You know, remember what it was like with my, uh... Darumaka in black and white? You know, I don't really want another one of that. So I'm actually just going to cut until I can catch this. Because I don't want to waste tape. And, you know, it could take a while. Do you remember Darumaka? Yeah. So, see you in a sec. What? Okay, I'm back. I found another Ponyta, and now I will cut. So, just because I feel like. Yeah, I caught a Ponyta. <sighs> My ice water needs more ice. Okay, Ponyta data was added to the Pokedex. Blah blah blah. The Fire Horse Pokemon. Uh, nickname. Let's see. Uh, you guys are gonna love this. And I'm just gonna say something. This was not my original nickname. I saw it on a random Wi-Fi battle. I don't know what it is. 
I wish I had a good touch screen though. And you guys are probably gonna like this. Uh, you really do. Uh, no, that's not gonna work. I cannot see the bottom screen. Uh, you really do. Here we go. Now, almost done. No. Don't my. Finally, here we go. You guys want to see the nickname? And I'm back into this patch of grass. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I love that nickname. I just thought it would be a good nickname to use. I don't know who came up with it first. Um, I saw it somewhere in a Wi-Fi battle. I don't know which one, but it was a Wi-Fi battle, okay? And Pony has got pretty good levels. 23 is pretty good, so I'll just switch it with HM Slave V2. Now I'll switch you with Gigabolt and Aquazel with Gigabolt. And, and Pony is going to get a lot of experience on this route. That's all I'm going to say. I'm all five Pokemon before the fourth gym leader. Hmm. You know, I got to fix my screen before the next episode. Uh, experience share. I'm gonna give it the experience share, even though it's gonna be battling. Just to get more experience. And yeah, here we have a person. Yeah, a person. I never thought that would be here. What who? Yes, I beat someone that is using his favorite Pokemon. And over here, you can find a tiny mushroom. Whoa. It looks like I'm on top of the cliff edge there, not in the grass. Oh, Flippin Snagger Muffins! Okay, now, out of that place of grass there. Uh, oh, great, I didn't see the trainer. Um, apparently, I'm battling this trainer that I didn't see. But I see it now. Okay, wow, I almost got knocked out. Well, Bonsai did. I mean, I'm just sitting here playing a video game. I mean, there's no reason that I get knocked out unless just someone came up behind me and, like, slapped me in the... No, no one would slap me in the face, like, hit me in the head, maybe. No, you wouldn't slap me in the face, but you'd punch me in the head. Great. I don't know, would you? Would you guys, the awesome fans of awesomeness? Wow. Uh, yeah, now coming back over here, the DS screen will keep falling. Uh, you can find a wild Pokemon. Uh, just now coming back after knocking out the Cricketoon with my Ponyta. My little pony. Yeah, no one says that word anymore. And no, I don't feel like slapping the bark with honey. But I don't feel like running into wild Pokemon. Jeez. But you know, I just realized something. To put the, to put my Bidoof, or egg I mean, in the PC. Yeah, Bidoof is an Bidoof egg. Same thing. Go look at, ugh. Don't you hate wild Pokemon interrupting what you're saying? Well, I didn't have to cut the video there, but I just wanted to. 
But, okay. But I was gonna say, you look up, you know, look up Bidoof in the dictionary, you'll find a, or look up back in the dictionary, you'll find a picture of Bidoof, I don't know. I can't really remember what I was about to say. Because, you know, the stupid wild Pokemon that always interrupts me. Blah. Oh yeah, there's a big group right there. Then, coming over here, you will find one last trainer. Oh wow, apparently not. Actually, yes. Who just has really poor vision and lets me walk right by him. Okay, collector. Okay, uh, the disc just ran out of space, as you see on there, so, uh, nothing else happened in the video, that was pretty much it, so, thanks for watching this part of my shiny Pokemon Diamond and Pearl walkthrough. I will see you guys next time. Later. Oh, Flippin' Snagger Muffins!